Lord here. We're back with Elteth Warfare Part 3, I believe it, believe it is. Um, NATO has finally arrived. And, they've, and they have their invasion set up. And unknowingly, I have, I just went out to the north. I didn't know, they didn't tell us about their fleet. But they've, but we found their fleet, which had, um, is way up north. Um, where is it? Um, um, no, it's over here. This is the whole Na uh, U.S. Navy fleet. Or, um, the NATO fleet. Got back, um, it hit. Well, I went up here, unknowingly ran into the NATO fleet. And they brought me to Stratus, where I was officially accepted in the NATO forces. And then they brought me back, and and I have to took off from the Stratus Air Base, and I have to try to bomb an AAF convoy. Up, oh, um, turn on. Uh, en route from Core to a Geo's Daily COs. The reason we have to stop this convoy is. NATO forces have told us that, um, that they've been recruiting some of the locals as spies, which I think is pretty good, and, um, and they've been, and this convoy is en route to the Geo's Daily Seals, because this is where we have most of our agents, in the this is where most of our agents are. Most of the, the local agents are um, just kind of hiding in here. That's where most of them are. And we have to bomb it. But we're hoping we can actually um, attack them without actually, without CSAT involvement. You see here the, the main airport is under heavy CSAT control. Oh, uh. they, got, they got some of their neofrons. Got some of their... Uh, there are other vehicles too. See, there's an officer here. It looks like he's kind of debriefing these men. Mostly helicopter, mostly pilots, a paratrooper, a rifleman. They have this. They have this small portion of um, the international airport, the main airport. Meanwhile, the AAF have this. Have this other portion. See, they're kind of he's kind of debriefing the these pilots, the officer, the whole map. What else? What else is there? And meanwhile, in, in Glananera Bay, that's where we will land. And we are planning the whole attack on the Molos airfield. But the good news is the FIA have assembled a really large force to kind of um distract the AAF. So at least they'll be more focused on them rather than us, so we can catch them by surprise. We should be expecting no resistance at at it. We should be expecting a few PT boats, and that's pretty much all of it. We should be able to time it just right, so we can actually use our bombs on it. Okay, switching the bombs. We are flying here by the airbase, but we do not want to alert to these that forces. We do not want them to get involved. Flying by the city of the Thera, I believe. Because of a whole vacuum next to it. And I kind of dive down to get some speed, but I kind of want to decrease speed too. So I at least can actually slow down so I can bomb. We should be able to time it right. Maybe. This be good. I think this is the first time you guys have ever seen me actually fly jet. You know what I'm saying? 
but I have plenty of phone before. I played this scenario multiple fun times, so I should have a bit of practice after dropping bombs. Oh shoot! Missile, missile. Must must be AEF. I hope it's not so bad. What the heck? But there we go. There they come. Yep, I see them. They kind of. Oh, the troops will actually disembark once they spot us, and they'll kind of like get off the road too. Which I think that's kind of cool, but it's kind of unrealistic if it's. Oh jeez, are we getting? Oh crap, we're getting intercepted by an AAF by, by an AM-43. Uh, uh. Sorry, it's quite pretty early in the morning, so. Is he over me? Where is he? Oh. Oh crap, he's breaking off. I gotta... Okay, he's gonna break... He's trying to break off. Yep, I see him. He's breaking off. He may be a bit more maneuverable than me because he's obviously a bit smaller. Nope. Wow, what is this guy? This guy's got doing... Trying, what is this guy, this guy trying to do? An out maneuver me? Lock on. Okay, I got my fell chains locked on. Come on. I need to increase my speed because I, I can't. I have to catch up to him. Otherwise, I'll. Hit me. Yep, I, I think I hit him. He's, you see, he's, we can, we can, I think I'm nearby Kavala. Yep, it's the island of the capital. Come on, increase speed. Because if we. Oh, he's down. We got him. Yeah, he ejected. <laughs> I think we're gonna go back for that convoy because if we have to, because if we try to bomb it and while it's in the city, it will um um it, and we might kill a few civilians, which we don't want that. So I'm gonna go get my maces ready just in case if there's any mobile vehicles down there. I see some smoke, so I must have destroyed one. Yep, I see some. Okay, we got locked onto their APC. Yep, okay, we destroyed their armor. We gotta take, take out this MRAP, too. Strider. Boom! Eat that. Okay, well, what about the fourth bowl? I don't see it. Oh, I'm sure it's, supposed to, I'm sure it's gone. Because if, because if if they are alert to our presence, they will probably. Because if, if they notice us actually flying nearby the, the airbase, they will they'll probably try to retaliate, open fire upon us. Which we do not want to see that involvement right now. I will to still continue Alpha's warfare. This is not the last episode. And the, air, the airfields over there. I see the terminal. There, looks like there's a few vehicles down there. Airbase, I can kind of see something. I want to try to hit the the military this, this section of it. I see some looks like civilian vehicles, so there probably will be some civilians at it. Not well. I, I kind of want to destroy their uh, their aircraft. Get out of here! Get out of here, you punks! Yeah. Definitely destroyed that just my Gatling gun. Flung over that military lab, which was in um, the CSAT invasion of Altus. It was the same lab. Yep. Yeah, you got that. Um, we're heading nearby Paros, which is another highly populated area, because um, they're sending convoys into like highly populated areas, like for example, Paros, Calicori, Athera. Telos, highly populated areas, cause, cause they, cause they know that spies are actually sabotaging their militaries, and they don't want that to happen, and they don't want them actually affecting them too much. So they wanna, so that means the, it kind of means that they are that they are killing civilians. So 
trying to actually aim for the the officer under two two pilots has to be the officer kind of re briefing the soldiers, the, the pilots. Uh, and kinda of loop around so we can I kinda of wanna inflict a little bit of damage on C stats so they're not gonna retaliate against us because I have a feeling they will. Can't tell if we damaged that that on um, that Cadman helicopter. I can't tell if we did. I mean, we did destroy. So is it we actually destroyed two jets? Really? Or what? Or is that ground vehicle? I don't know. I don't remember destroying two jets. Oh my god! Might have been from one when I was firing with troopers. I kind of do want to attack the CSAT troops because I feel like they're going to attack. We don't want them to, but they probably will attack us anyways because I'm actually attacking them. I kind of want to sort that gunship, the their Cashman gunship. I mean, those things are really like some of the best vehicles in Arma. Okay, we did destroy that Cashman. That's not going to be a problem for right now. For now, I'm gonna go back around. Maybe I'm gonna fire my four my four macers so so I can actually um unload some of those. That ground vehicles. But of course, the AEF will want to get CSAT involved, right? Is that smoke? No, it's not in the, the city. At least it's not in the city. Otherwise, that tells me that vehicle must have gotten got in. I was about to have to attack. But I did put some FIA, FIA troops in there, so at least they can deal with anyone in there. But they're lightly, lightly armed though. I mean, you have an RPG, uh, an off-road, I believe. Hit this new farm. Q199. Boom. To the Mole's airfield now. Okay. Starting to run some fuel, but it's alright. I'm, I'm gonna loop back and try to hit another vehicle. But this does increase our speed though, but we're still fine. We're still fine. We're at like 40, 49, 49, or whatever. Well, kind of in our 81. But the cat went down. What the heck? Fire! Boom! That must have destroyed it. I did it? Really? Oh! Oh no! Well, things that actually happen in this actually kind of impact what, um, how this series will go. Flying near West Stavros and Nikori looks like. I do know a lot about the maps of Arma Free. So something I've still got two maces left. I gotta make sure they count. I wanna kinda hit number Neofron. Fire! Okay, did use all my streakers. They are anti-personnel, I believe, because it's an AP. So, I'm, so it probably doesn't probably won't do much. We destroyed that buzzer, the it's the smoke kind of fire kind of Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, actually I think we had enough kind of bothering them, so we gotta go ahead to remove those airfields, see what we're doing. Because that's gonna be our first airfield we have. Plus once we take once um the US troops take it, we will be able to we should be able to um, use it. Use it. See, we're gonna kind of land here. One no, I only have one maser. If there's any other vehicles left that weren't neutralized, I'll blow them up. Unless it's a friendly 
like an FIA vehicle or anything. Okay, 15 minutes. I went for that already. <sighs> I'm sure the mole of their family must have took it, but I'm sure they took casualties. Because, I mean, technicals are very, are actually very, very vulnerable. Yes, technicals are actually vulnerable. Pretty vulnerable. You know. Because when you're obviously on a truck with a machine gun, and you're kind of out in the open because you're on the back of it. So you're very, very vulnerable on them. So I'm sure they lost some technicals. A few maids got blown up because I, I mean there were a few APCs at the airfield, but they were gonna try to stop them up so we can so the troops can actually do their thing. Hopefully there's no they didn't take off any jets. I mean we did destroy one. Oh that looks like it's an enemy vehicle, it's a Kuma. We did have a bunch of gunships rolling. And we have a cannon. We did, we did do flush that Kuma tank. Guys, seriously, I actually have a lot of knowledge about Arma 3. Like, a lot of knowledge about the, the tanks and everything. We do have... Hopefully our PT boats can flood the enemies. Are those ours? They look like they're... Yep, those are our boats. We do have some helicopters. We have a few Hurons, a few Blackfoots, a few Ghost Hawks. If you did not know, if you don't know much about the Ghost Hawk, it's actually based off of the UH-60 Blackhawk, which is a really, um, pretty good helicopter. It's almost, almost looks exactly like it. It can carry eight, eight men, it can, has two miniguns, two pilots, like, like all, like almost all helicopters in armor. flying around and plus we don't have any real airfield to land at except for well except for the fact about the um remember in the last episode uh, the FIA seized a small airfield that the AAF were gonna abandon that was oh uh, we can't land there because the runway is too short for aircraft and that's the, and uh since the AAF say it's useless it's useless for us too because we try because we can't land a plane there so the airfield's completely useless, well, except for the fact that you can land helicopters there, right? Kind of flying around here. Not really doing much. Kind of over to under in Salt Lake. A large, large Salt Lake. There is like a, a small airstrip on it too, which is um, kind of good. In some parts, it's kind of good. It's even... That's Sophia. That's the comm station that we kind of use. That's what they use to contact us. I'm sure there's no FIA units there because most of them got wiped out out of most of the, the FIA troops actually got wiped out out of the uh, the northeast, the northeastern region. The northwestern region is absolutely crawling with FIA guerrillas. Absolutely crawling. I don't really have any real place to land, so just so just just because I'm probably gonna actually crash land, crash land it. If we speed, if we speed. Oh God, I'm landing on the road. Oh my god! <laughs> I kind of ran over myself. I look so awkwardly dead. And my leg is bent. <laughs> well, that's our free physics for you. It's my jet. Why do I feel like I'm skydiving? Why do I feel like I'm skydiving? That's cool. Where's my jet? My jet so
Oh my gosh! Look at all the FIA vehicles. I mean, they got look like they're absolutely destroyed. Okay, what's that? What's that? There's um, a technical over there. There were a ton of technicals. Oh, all the fans to win from the jet. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, a few black ones did go down. But it's okay. We have some that are hovering. I mean, we definitely control the skies over the Molo's airfield. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I'd be happy to do this. Let's see. I hope you guys did enjoy the video so far, but but we we have see well, safe right now we have saved the airfield, but I'll continue killing these guys. Hope you guys did enjoy the video, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.